Hi guys. Um, I wanted to do a serious video today. Um, one thing I noticed on a lot of videos, even today and lately, and it's like I know it's not my videos, but like it's it's getting annoying and it's getting messed up and taken over the top. Um, disrespectful comments on videos that are not meant to be the kind that you say mean comments about like um like memorials and special videos that mean something to someone uh... like i even saw one which is why i'm making this video because of this specific one um, a woman made a memorial video slideshow kind of thing for her for her child that had passed away um, and I'm looking at the comments because I was going to comment on it and uh, say my uh, forgiveness and stuff like that for her loss and I see people commenting to the same person over and over and over I found the comment and what this person put was completely completely out of line especially for a video that um, that is supposed to be meant for a memorial and a memory not trying to be the better person in that situation there's nothing to be saying oh I had more life threat more life threatening things and near death experience than that kid and I moved on are you kidding me I mean what is wrong with you I'm not pointing fingers at anybody I'm not going to say names even though I want to but I am not because that would be out of line but what this person did he was replying to everybody that was replying to this kid and the one comment that he said that was completely disrespectful was saying about the mother and pretty much what he said he's like he was quoting somebody that um that had replied to him and he said the most incredible thing we're looking at this girl's fat not gonna curse um, her fat mm, was probably the cause of this kid's death. You don't go and do that. Let it, what, like I've seen a couple of comments that are like that on the memorial videos, especially trying to be better than other people. And I've even seen videos like they do it to people who work hard on their videos, people who take time to show people or try to warn people and show awareness to something and they think that it's just one big joke that they can comment and that oh they can't find me they can't do this it's still wrong like probably your own friends and family can even possibly see what you're commenting and it's wrong to tell you the truth and I even looked up the kid who had said this this kid was literally, I don't know, like between the ages of 12 and 16, I couldn't tell. He had videos of like his cats and stuff like that, and he's going and calling this woman names, and she just went through something. There are a lot of people who go through this stuff, and people think that is just one big joke that it's for attention. No, it's not. The video is to be shown to those who are going through the same thing, who are sending it to family, sending it to friends, to loved ones, to show people that you're not alone, that you that we went through a similar situation. We're here for you. I've seen many, many videos on here, and every video that I've seen, almost every video, has at least one mean out of line comment it's even if it's to even if it has nothing to do with the video the person will comment to other people's comments calling them stupid and all this stuff this is one of the reasons why people go through depression and stuff like that and make things worse Pre like form spring is a big example that 
you could stupidly put anonymously and you think that, um, oh, this person's not going to find out it's me. Oh, la, 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 I could do this. There's even a girl that actually committed suicide because of Form Spring and the comments that she was getting. And people were advertising this girl's Form Spring. And everybody was like, oh my god, she's such an idiot and all this stuff. Saying that she's over dramatic. It's because of other people who don't think. I even put a post, I tried putting a post on before. I'm going to put what I was going to uh, put as my YouTube status down in the description bar. Think before you say something. Because some, somewhere you're going to say the wrong thing and it's going to cause the biggest mistake. Because you wouldn't like it happening to you. Like, you don't see me going around saying, oh, I went through this, 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 and calling people names. No. Because in the back of my head, I would regret it. It would kill me, probably. It would eat me up that I did something like that. And for this person to just keep on going, they have no heart. I know I'm being judgmental. I'm usually not judgmental. But it's messed up. It's completely disrespectful, if, especially to those who work hard on those videos. Like, like I saw a status the other day, and the person was, this was a fandoming thing, I'm not going to say names. Um, they were doubting themselves on, on their voice acting. And it was because of other people commenting on the video, oh, you sound like the same thing over and over and over and over. When actually he didn't. And he started believing it. And I had messaged him and I told him, don't listen to what they say. You do it to feel accomplished and not to please anybody. Do it to feel accomplished about yourself. Which is why, like, which is why I don't like when people take fan dubbing so seriously like if you guys remember the rant that me and Laura did a while back about people taking fan dubbing so seriously comments are taken out of control on every single video on YouTube and somewhere it's gonna cause the biggest mistake you would see all over the news like um, I saw a video advertised the other day. Um, it was a news thing that said a kid pretty much, um, what's the way to put it, pretty much killed himself on the internet, had it on webcam, and had thousands upon thousands of people watching. And they were just sitting there, people were urging him on, thinking it was fake. And those few who actually do have a heart called the police. But when the police got there, they were too late. And the, they you would actually see the police going into the room. I didn't see the video, nor do I want to. But long story short, this is pretty much the lesson of the day. And I hope that you guys are watching this. And send this to those who are going through stuff that are um, getting mean comments, doubting themselves, thinking low of themselves anything in that category or even if you're one of those who are comment thinking about putting a nasty comment or anything like that think before you act because judgment will follow because really it's it's messed up I mean come on you're gonna probably get caught sooner or later or it's gonna cause the biggest thing and everybody's gonna be pointing fingers at you but I hope you guys listen and just know that if you guys no matter who you guys are if you ever need anything you can message me comment down here if you have my Skype Skype me you guys know even if even if we only talked once and you need someone to talk to or vent to you can message me comment whatever I will message you one two three I will message you right away um, but please 
be careful guys be careful out on the internet be careful even out in the world um, because it's a crazy place but we all know that there's one person that's looking out for all of us whether we're doing the wrong thing or the right thing there's only one person that's watching out for all of us and he created us but I hope you guys listen to this video even though it's over 10 minutes I'm sorry but I had to get the word out but please please I hope you guys listened um, have a great week have a great few days have a nice weekend if you guys ever need anything no matter what time it is or whatever I will comment right away but I hope you guys have a nice night God bless